Ghost to see challenge, you can pick the skin color. Starting off with the age. If your favorite color is purple, make the age zero to three years old. If your favorite color is pink, make the age four to six years old. If your favorite color is black, make the age seven to eight years old. If your favorite color is red, make the age nine to 10 years old. If your favorite color is green, make the age 11 to 13 years old. If your favorite color is blue, make the age 14 to 15 years old. If your favorite color is yellow, make the age 16 to 17 years old. If your favorite color is orange, make the age 18 years old. If your favorite color is any other color or you don't have a favorite color, pick an age between zero and 18. Now for the gender. If you have long hair, make a girl. If you have short hair, make a boy. And if you have medium hair, make whatever gender you want. To determine the cause of death, if you have green, blonde, pink, or red hair, then make the cause of death either any sort of illness or electrocution. If you have brown, black, blue, or purple hair, then make the cause of death either a car wreck, ran over by a train, or an airplane crash. If you are bald, then make the cause of death either drowning or fire. If you have any other hair color, instead of making it a real ghost, make it a human dressed up as a ghost. For the hair color, base it off your pet. If you have a reptile, make the hair color green. If you have a bird, make the hair color red. If you have a dog, make the hair color brown. If you have a cat, make the hair color orange. If you have any other pets, make the hair color teal. If you don't have any pets, make the hair color black. And if you have multiple kind of pets, make the hair color gray. For the eye color, make it the color of your favorite animal. If your favorite animal is mostly two colors, make one eye one color and the other eye the other color. If you don't have a favorite animal, add a blindfold. Lastly, any extras. If you wear glasses, add freckles. If you are the only child, add a flower crown. If you play any instruments, make your OC's name start with an A. If you have Pinterest, add earrings. If you have Snapchat, add a stuffed animal that your OC brings everywhere. If you have Facebook, add a mask. If you have Instagram, add a hair clip. If you have TikTok, add a bow. If you have Spotify, add headphones. And if you watch anime, add a hat. Potter OC Challenge. You can choose the age, gender, and skin color. However, the age has to be between 11 and 18. Next, pick a number between one and four. The number you choose will determine the blood status of your OC. If you choose one, your OC is a pure blood. If you choose two, your OC is a half blood. If you choose three, your OC is a muggle-born. I'm not going to say the offensive version of this word. And if you choose four, your OC is a squib. Hair length. If you have short hair in real life, give your OC medium length hair. If you have medium length hair in real life, give your OC long hair. And if you have long hair in real life, Give your OC short hair. Hair color is determined by the hair color of your favorite Harry Potter character. If your favorite Harry Potter character has black hair, examples include Harry Potter and Severus Snape, then give your OC brown hair. Any shades of brown are acceptable. If your favorite Harry Potter character has brown hair, examples include Hermione Granger and Rubius Hagrid, then give your OC blonde hair. If your favorite Harry Potter character has blonde hair, examples include Luna Lovegood and Draco Malfoy, then give your OC orange hair. If your favorite Harry Potter character has orange hair, examples include Ron Weasley and Lily Potter, then give your OC black hair. And lastly, if your favorite Harry Potter character has any other hair color, then you can choose. Eye shape is your choice, and eye color is your favorite color. Your OC's house is determined by the season you were born in. If you were born in the spring, your OC is a Hufflepuff. If you were born in the summer, your OC is a Gryffindor. If you were born in the fall, your OC is a Ravenclaw. And if you were born in the winter, your OC is a Slytherin. You can choose the cloves. The cloves can be their Hogwarts robes, their Quidditch robes, casual clothing, etc. You can also choose the clothing colors, but they must have some of your OC's house colors. Gryffindor being red and gold, Slytherin being green and silver, Ravenclaw being blue and bronze, 
and Hufflepuff being yellow and black. Now it's time to move on to accessories. Accessories are determined by the Hogwarts house you are sorted in. If you don't know what your house is, you can take the Hogwarts house test on the Wizarding World website. If you don't want to take the test or you just can't, pick the house you think you fit in or at least your favorite house. If you're a brave Gryffindor, give your OC a hat of your choice. If you're an ambitious Slytherin, give your OC a magical and valuable necklace. If you're a smart Ravenclaw, give your OC glasses and or a book. And if you're a kind Hufflepuff, give your OC a flower accessory and or a scarf. You can choose the type of wand your OC can have, what it's made of, its core, etc. Your OC's Patronus is determined by the Patronus you have. If you don't know what your Patronus is, you can take the Patronus quiz on the Wizarding World website. If you're unable to, or don't want to, then just pick your favorite animal. MA OC Challenge You can pick the skin color, age, and gender yourself. All right, now for the eyes. If your favorite anime is Hunter x Hunter, add black eyes. If your favorite anime is My Hero Academia, add green eyes. If your favorite anime is Attack on Titan, add brown eyes. If your favorite anime is Naruto, add orange eyes. If your favorite anime is anything else, add blue eyes. Now for hair. If your favorite anime character is male, add long hair. If your favorite anime character is female, add short hair. If your favorite anime character is anything else, add medium hair. The hair color should be the color of your favorite anime character's eyes. For species, if your favorite anime is Demon Slayer, make your OC a demon. If your favorite anime is Tokyo Ghoul, make your OC a ghoul. If your favorite anime is Sword Art Online, make your OC a video game character. If your favorite anime is anything else, make your OC human. For clothes, if your favorite character is kind or overly happy, make the clothes cute. If your favorite character is angry, make the clothes rebellious. If your favorite character is kindo or fully emotionless, in other words, doesn't really express happiness. Give your OC covering clothes. If your favorite anime character is anything else, make the clothes sporty. The clothes color palette should match that of your favorite anime's protagonist. For accessories, if you're a girl, add freckles or blush. If you're a boy, add glasses or earrings. If you're anything else, add a scar. You can choose head accessories yourself. Base the accessories color of your favorite My Hero Academia character. If you haven't watched My Hero Academia, remove the head accessories.